So this year I flew to a city in the UK called Manchester. It was the place to be for Smurf 2024. Besides the amazing models that you have seen there, like droids and other stuff, there was some other cool models from a very familiar designer. Let's dive right in. If you are looking to design, whether it is a art piece or a painting, you know, there's a signature. This signature tells more about the designer behind the artwork. We see here a lot of cool models. And you know from whom it is. But how does the guy look like? Well, you're going to find out right now. And he's just standing right here next to me. This is the amazing designer behind all the amazing, very beautiful models. Thank you. I, my, my name is Fulvio. Um, I'm known as uh, Fulv, which is F-U-L-V. The I design 3D printing models. So tell so, me more about your amazing models that we have sitting right, right okay. here. So I can start with the Christmas castle. And uh, as you can see, it comes in two different uh, sizes. This is the mini version and this is the standard full size. And the mini version comes with the winter pack. As you can see, it's got snow detailing for Christmas. Full size one, as is shown at the moment, has a summer pack with uh, summer details, flowers and so on. When you buy the castle, you also get the winter pack. So all of this becomes like the mini one with all in white. And in the future, I'm planning to do different season packs. Wow. That, that can be added. So your castle can change with the season. And then next to it, we see a Art Deco cinema, which is also a TV remote control holder. At the back. Serious? Yeah, at the, end, at the back there are simple tube pockets on which you can put your remote control and the front where it says movie night can be customized to uh, pre be printed with um, your favorite movie titles and this nice. space here on the left and the right you can actually put pictures and posters and movies that you like e even with the li little things something like that yeah there are lots of different things you can do basically you can customize as much as you like it's designed to show the lights like neon lights as you can see the, li the line lights up because the thickness of the plastic where the lines are is thinner and that allows to, for the light to come through just a line neon which is a typical effect that they used to in our deco design next to it we have a theater and the theater has three different functions it can be a light box as you can see it is from the staging, the oh, stage yeah. is done in cool. layers. Each layer can be simply changed and in the future there will be different set design so that people can have different uh, stages basically. The second function is it's a puppet theatre. So you you take the roof off and you have access to the stage with uh, puppets and strings. This theatre is also being printed in the past by someone with a, a Prusa XL yeah. at 160% scale and that is a much bigger theatre and it works even better as a puppet theatre. This is just to show how you can change the set, a simple layer that can be replaced. That is so amazing. And the curtain, this is the standard curtain, but there is a version of the curtain with a, a cutout that allows you to have your phone screen behind and use it as a cinema. So that is the theatre and it's based on a French style of opera house. I, I love it. It's it's so so versatile. You can do so many things with it. You can customize it and it's printable with or without AMS and all the color changes are at the layer height. There's very very little wastage and that applies to all my models. So all the color changes are at a layer height. They all come with um, PDF files that tells you exactly which layer to change the color to pause the printer. Lots of them comes with a Bamboo Lab project file included, so everything is done for you. So the, the next model is a, what I call the a Christmas Park. It's a very quick print and it uses simple techniques, a little bit of color change and layer height. Also use a vase mode for the Christmas tree. The lighting is very simple, it's uh, wire lights you can buy anywhere and you just uh, move them around the base inside the Christmas tree and you can even put the light inside the, the snowman. And then you see the uh, hot air balloons lamps. This is the mini hot air balloon and this is the standard size. 
This comes, this is the startup version that allows you to have two different color combinations, but the bundle version has different way you print the segment and allows you to have more color combination, also to have the entire balloon printed in one part, you know, entire top part and entire bottom part, maybe with rainbow filaments and things like that. Wow. Again, this uses yeah. a very small technique to allow the light to shine through and, and again, full instruction are provided to help you along the way. And this is the Christmas house. The usual, the, once you printed one of my models, you soon get used to the way I work and every model it kind of uses the same methods. So uh, your first model will be uh, discovering how I do my model and then afterwards you, you will be much quicker because you know how I work. But the usual techniques, very easy to print. And this one has some glitter glue that you can buy from a hobby shop. You brush it on it and when it dries it just leaves the glitter effect and it makes it a little bit more Christmassy. And this is the countdown nice. to Christmas. So you can change the number of the days to Christmas every day. And so also a little bit of an event calendar. Exactly, yeah. Nice. Then next to it is the, the latest model, which is a toy factory. And this toy factory comes in two different versions, a static version, which has a conveyor belt that does not move and is all printed in PLA. When you print a static version, it looks identical to the moving version. But if you like the conveyor belt to be moving, as you can see, by printing a couple of parts in a TPU, then uh, uh, you can print the version with the moving conveyor belt. So this is available as a static version alone, or a bundle which comes with both and again the other lighting you see here is a very simple LED strip light that you can buy from Amazon or in other places and I help you also by telling you how to look the, the actual LEDs around the model. The next model is the Haunted House uh, 2 bundle where you see that comes with uh, a court a haunted hill also this lantern at the moment are not are not lit up but you can actually wire some um, christmas uh, wire light inside you can actually see if i take this off you can see how you can put a little wire lights inside and that will illuminate the graveyard as well this uh, model comes with the option of don't or not having a moon on top if you prefer just a simple roof and also comes with texture wall like this which is kind of broken down texture walls but if you prefer like in a brand new looking house also comes with the walls which are Pristine. Uh, yeah. That's right. Next to it, we have uh, another Halloween model, which is the Haunted Manor. And Haunted Manor uses lights in, in a different way, like the toy factory in a way, not only in the building, but also on the floor, utilizing the same simple LED strip light. The effect uh, is quite dr uh, dramatic. Probably in person, it has even more effect to that on pictures or videos but you can see uh, how the light shows on the floor and through the window uh, this model comes with uh, also option of different trees like for example this is a, a pumpkin and this is like a, a tree type of tree but if people prefer they can use a dead tree instead with a skull base or a um, pumpkin base as you can see over there okay. so and um, I always give option to people to customize the model the way they they prefer or they like and it's quite details it's very popular model you can also view a few videos around the internet YouTube of uh, people showing how it goes together but of course full instruction step-by-step -step instruction are including uh, including animated online instruction this is a model Model of a carousel which is a mechanical you can actually use a little key that goes inside like this and then the horses go up and down so the, beautiful I am thinking that in the future I will do an add-on they will incorporate a kiosk which uh, where you can put a motor yeah a USB motor that will motorize the actual movement as well uh, at the moment is mechanical like this and of course the lights again strip lights you can change colors with your phone very cheap to buy and but very effective and this is a bird's house small uh, bird house bird's house and this is designed for english birds comes with different ring depends on which birds you want to attract 
to your garden, the instruction will tell you which ring diameter to use for the type of birds you want to attract. And when you build it, you make sure you use that size ring. You can access to the inside very easily by taking the, the lid off so you can clean the inside if needed. Yeah. And then um, clean it and then put it back. And it comes with a bracket that you can then screw to a tree or anywhere or to a fence in the garden or just simply as a decoration. Really. Where can people uh, find all these models? You can, uh, I have two main places. If you just want to buy one model, um, my Colt 3D page is, um, is where you can buy a model of your choice but if you have the subscription base patrons of uh, thanks my patron at the moment is sold out but i'm using thanks as an alternative which is actually better because automatically release the models for you and if you join thanks you you have an option of a monthly subscription or a yearly subscription if you if you choose the monthly subscription you have access to one model per month if you choose the yearly subscription you have all the models available to you from day one on top of that in the next 12 months you will have access to all the new model coming out in the next 12 months so at the moment if you do join my thanks or use my cold 3d with the code smurf 2024 which is S M R R F 2024 all one word you get 20% off on all the models on my calls and also 20% off the first month of subscription on fans thank you very much you're welcome thank you very much uh, if you're not subscribed please consider subscribing like this video